Hello friends, welcome back. I'm back so soon and my hair is different. I got my hair done yesterday. Do you like it? I got it professionally done. So like, look at how crispy these parts are. Today's video is gonna be all about Alphalete's Black Friday sale. Woo woo! The last couple months have been some of my favorite drops that Alphalete has ever done. I know you guys have heard me say this, I'm a broken record. But if you're looking to try Alphalete, this is the time to try Alphalete because every single thing on the website is gonna be on sale. Every single thing, old things, new things. The categories are 10%, 30%, and 50%, but I didn't tell you the best part. You can stack it with an athlete code. So our codes give you 10% off. So realistically, even if you're buying a 10% off item, if you stack it with my 10% using code friends, that's 20%. So, oh, did I just? I just spit on you, I'm so sorry. <laughs> At the very least, everything on the site is 20% off. That's insane, and there's so many good things coming out. I'm gonna go through everything today, the new things that are coming out, and then some of my just fan favorites that I just have been gravitating towards. Okay, the sale is gonna be four days long. It starts November 24th at midnight, central time, midnight. So if you're in Arizona, then that's 11 p.m. If you're in California, then that's 10 p.m. So it's really the 23rd, depending on where you are in the world. Because this is the biggest sale of the year, and I really appreciate everyone who's been using my Alphalete code so far this year, I want to do a huge giveaway. So for the first 24 hours of the sale, if you shop using code FRIENDS and you send me an email to this email address, then I will enter you into my giveaway where I'm gonna be giving away five hundred dollar gift cards so then you can use it for the remainder of the sale days. Yeah, I just really appreciate you guys just for standing by me no matter what. Ah, rah, rah. I think that's everything. Are you ready? Are you ready for this? Are you ready for it? Meryl, Meryl, Meryl. That, that was a lot. I just wanna say really quickly, <laughs> I feel so professional right now. <laughs> I'm just gonna say really quickly, I am fighting the sun. So half of this might be in the dark. The sun sets so early. Some of this is already out. I just wanted to include some of my favorite pieces that I've been wearing lately a lot. Isn't this outfit so cute? Also my slippers, they're from American Eagle. We have Amplify, we have Aura, and then we have the new Origin collection as well. The Origin collection is more like athleisure. First things first, we did have a change to the flare pant. I don't have the new flare pants. I thought I ordered them, but I got two leggings on accident and not one of the flare pants, because I wasn't thinking. Now we have a regular version and a tall version. This is my caveat with the Aura flare pants. So sizes extra, extra small to small have a different measurement than the mediums on up. The mediums on up are already a little bit longer. That's why I was so confused when everybody started trying on the flare pant the first time. And I'm 5'7", so they hit me pretty much at the perfect spot. But everyone else, they looked so short on them. It's because I wear a medium in all of the bottoms and they all wear the like extra smalls to smalls. So theirs were already a little shorter and mine were already a little longer. But now, like I said, we do have the long and the regular version. I saw Bailey Stewart posted that the inseam for the extra smalls that she wears is 31 inches and then the tall is 33 inches. But I wear a medium, so the mediums are starting off at 32 inches. Here's me showing you proof. Unless I measured this wrong, but I'm pretty sure I measured it right. And if you see, they're 32 inches. I mean, if they're adding two inches like they did to the other ones, then if you get the tall this time around, it should be 34 inches. I assume they would add two inches onto those sizes as well. These are the regular ones from the previous launch, the ones that we just measured in their 32 inch inseam. Again, I'm 5'7". They fit like this, but I feel like they fit me better because I think that they're meant to be mid-rise leggings. I mean, flare pants. Do you see my belly button is exposed? But once we start hiking them up, trying to like, this is how we wear our things, right? High rise. They don't naturally sit here on me. I have to hike them up. So when I'm hiking them up, they become way shorter. So I think that is another issue that was happening is that all of us were <laughs> pulling them up our butts, <laughs> which I know we always do. Like this is, this is not a new thing, but I think these are truly meant to be mid-rise because they fit me so well when I wear them mid-rise. I needed my slippers, my dogs are out. This fabric is very soft. These are not compressive at all. They're, they really just hug you. And that's why I like wearing them so often because I don't feel squished in. I can wear these on the plane. That's how you know. When you can wear things on the plane, you know you found something good. Okay, I actually got the long pants in. So this is where they sit on me if I don't have any shoes on. These are definitely an inch and a half to two inches longer. I don't have a measuring tape with me here, but they are longer. I'm gonna show you what they look like when I put my 9060s on. I honestly think this is the perfect length for me because I don't want them dragging on the ground and getting dirty. Ah, it's all girl friendly and these are with me hiking them up. Just dibble and dabble a little bit more, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. 
I right, so conscious. Uh, when I kiss you, I get a spark. Your body. We have some really cute colors coming out. We have still water, dusty rose, dove, and then we also have sage. But I don't have any of the sage things in the amplify. So those are the amplify colors that are coming out. The Aura colors are so pretty. So we have cran, so cute. It's just so festive. And this one is my favorite color coming out. This is so freaking pretty. This is cypress. It, oh, this with the white sports bra, you guys saw me wear that in my last video. I'm obsessed. I'm like a Christmas tree. We have ink as well. Aw, you guys made me ink. You knew I was gonna do, you knew it. You knew. We also have aster, black, and white. As you can tell, I'm not really a purple gal. I don't gravitate to purple. First product I'm gonna talk about are the shrugs because this is something that came out of left field for me. I didn't know I was gonna gravitate towards these as much as I have. I feel like they have this magical way of just elevating an outfit. They have thumb holes as well. I originally got the more neutral colors in a size small, but this one is a medium and I like the way the medium fits it's a little better. Yeah, I think it's true to size if you want it to feel a little bit more roomy. Size up. Every single time I wear a shrug in the gym, someone compliments me. They're like, oh my God, where did you get that? Or if I see another girl with a shrug in the gym, we're like, it's a very soft material, but definitely you could still work out in it. Dog, yeah. Used to stay up late to just talk. We was moving fast, trying not to get caught. Them your skin so soft. Let me open up your heart, cause life too short till death do its part. Uh, knew it from the start, you be the one I'm pushing cards with. In the supermarket, you know I love the star shit. Took you to my crib, yeah, I can't. The back is very short, which, you know, I think is good because then you get to see a lot of the sports bra, but I would like it to be a little longer. That's just a personal preference, but it's not bad. It's just very short. Next up, I wanna talk about the Aura Strappy Bra. So this is the one that has the four straps in the back. I really like this option because I feel like it's the perfect middle ground. So we have, which I'll talk about a little bit later, the tank top, which is like full coverage, obviously. It's almost just like a crop top. And I think these two paired together look fantastic. None of these sports bras come with pads, but this one does have the little slits in the side so you can slide pads in. I just always slide them in. They always just stay, you know? I feel like all the sports bras that are coming out right now are light support. They fit me tight, and I'm not the best person to ask because I don't have any boobs. Definitely for smaller chested girlies. I'd say that goes for all the sports bras in this. This is the time for the itty bitty titty committee <laughs> to rise up, I guess. Next, we're gonna be talking about the Aura Sculpt bra. I really, really wanted to like this bra, but it's not one of my favorite. The armpit holes are really tight. I can feel them. It's up in my pits, it's up in there. If it just came down a little bit more, that would make a world of difference. Also, the first generation of this one was the neutral. Let me go grab that real fast. The difference between the two bras is now we have a little line in the front by like the boob area, which allows for a little bit more of a dip because this one didn't have that. And I realized once I wore this in the gym, if I raised my arms up, straight under boob, spilling out. It looked like I had cleavage. They tried to fix that on this one and they did fix it slightly, but I still noticed when I raised my arms up, it comes up a little bit. I think you could sit out on this one. It's very cute on. It's, I don't think it's functional for the gym. Well, it's functional if you're not doing upper body day. Don't try to do pull-ups in this. Lift anything above your head because it's gonna slide up. And I don't have boobs, so I feel like I can't even imagine girls with boobs. This is the last Aura bra from the previous collection. And if you notice, if I just even do movements like this, <laughs> imagine me doing pull-ups and pulling myself up you already see under boob coming out. Like, I wanna like it because I like this style of bra, but you're, you're gonna, it's, you're gonna slip out underneath. From the last drop, this is a small. I actually sized up in the next one, so I'll show you that right now. You can see they added this little line right here at the bottom. Again, there's no padding in it, so you're just gonna see everything. Sorry about that. It scoops down slightly more. This one is a medium, but when I lift my arms up, I do pull-ups a lot, so my arms are literally this far, like above my head, and I'm pulling myself up. You see it still came up. You can still see a little of that under boob. And I don't wanna spend money for my bra to like, slide up or worry that it's gonna slide up. Also coming out in this collection is more colors of the bandeau bra. I'm not a huge fan of it. It's loose in some places and it seems tight at the same time. It's not my favorite one. And honestly, I've tried to do the bandeau thing in the gym and I don't really like it. <laughs> it doesn't stay up and I don't know if everyone else has that issue. I will say, I think it's really cute just for athleisure. It has a little sticky part along the top that helps it stay up. With the shrug, it looks so 
cute. I love that they did that combination because I haven't seen anyone do that. Is it functional? I don't think so. But if you just want to look cute, I mean, pick it up. I think that it's true to size. I am typically a small in the sports bras and I got a small. If you have no cleavage, you can get away with sizing down if you want to make sure it's like really tight. But yeah, if you have boobs, I wouldn't size down because they're going to they're gonna escape. Next up, we have the Aura leggings. I go through waves where I really love leggings and then I don't love leggings. I don't have much to say about these. They have cute little contouring on the side. Light, medium compression, not super compressive. Um, I wore them in the gym. I thought they looked really cute. You know, it's just like a standard old pair of leggings. I don't have a lot to say. They have a cute V contour in the back. They match well with the other colors, the sports bras, you know, mix and match. If I was gonna pick, I would get the flare over a pair of leggings. The Amplify leggings over these ones still, just cause that's more my go-to. I don't think they make your butt look horrible but I don't think they do anything special for it. So that's why I think that I would still go with the Amplify over another pair of leggings right now, personally. But it's just like a nice cute option if you just want something different than the Amplify. We're running out of sun. Okay, hold on. And some sawfish, breakfast in the morning, making waffles and some sausage. Girl, you blow my mind like a Nintendo game cartridge. But when I'm not around, yeah, I think about you often. Some I am an Aura short gal. Now, I love the Aura shorts. I think they look really cute on. These ones are five inch inside. Seam. I'm just gonna tell you guys every pair of shorts I wear roll up on me I like a five inch inseam I don't like biker shorts because I feel like they squeeze my legs and it makes me self-conscious So just letting you guys know but with ev with every brand I wear if the shorts are five inch inseam they roll up on me but honestly I kind of like it when they do that because Makes my butt look bigger. <laughs> I'm a fan. <laughs> what can I say? What can nope, I'm not doing that anymore. I'm retired. It's so dark in here. <laughs> I didn't make it. You know, this is giving what is that movie called? I am legend. The sun's going down, we we need to stay in the light. <gasps> That was the saddest movie. Gosh, why did I bring that up? Oh, one of my other favorite things from this collection are the Razorback tank tops. Sometimes I just don't feel like wearing a sports bra to the gym. I wanna have more coverage. I wish it was like an inch or two shorter. I think if it hit the waistband of the Amplify shorts and leggings, that would be perfect. I love the little logo at the bottom corner. It is not compressive at all. I got one in still water and one in white. I honestly want to pick up the other colors too because I don't know. It's just like a nice go-to. It's like a nice material. It's really soft. Also, I just feel like fitness brands are so weird with tank tops. It's either they have none or they make them too long or they like, you know, there's always something weird going off tank tops. No one could just make a regular tank top. <laughs> like, can we just have a regular tank top? <laughs> so I feel like this is the closest one to a regular tank top that I have seen so far. I just wish it was just a little bit shorter, but I do like them. We got the Amplify shorts up next. These are four and a half inseam, standard Amplify. You guys know the drill. We know Amplify. There's just new colors and they're really pretty. Although I will say that I really, really gravitate to the darker, richer colors of the Aura collection rather than the Amplify ones, at least for this launch. But you can mix and match them really cute. Last, we have the Amplify leggings. You guys know about the Amplify leggings. If you want something that makes your butt look good, this is the staple. Everybody loves the Amplify ones. So we just have them in different colors. I don't have much to say about that. I have anxiety about the sun going down also. So I really, really wish I had the halter bras to show you. I think the halter bras paired with the shrug are gonna look so cute. I got to try this bra on when I was in Houston and I really, really like it, but I didn't take any content because it was already two days of shooting and I was tired and now I regret it, obviously, because I don't have the bra here. Friends, I got the halter top. I am in Tahoe right now in a cabin. Uh, as you can tell, it's been taking me like three days to film this video, but I got the halter top and I'm gonna show you. So this is what it looks like with the shrug on. Ah, so cute. Like, isn't that just so cute? I love it. I love it. I love stylish active wear. Here, let me show you what it looks like without a shrug on. This is what we're working with. I think that it's very true to size. I'm wearing a small. You can adjust the strap up here. There's a little slider adjustable thing. And then on the back, it says alphalete. I just love this. I love wearing bras like this for back day because it just makes my back look so good. This is very light support. I don't feel this digging into my neck, especially because we can adjust this strap. I feel like that is the game changer. And then here is the black halter. I just wanted to show you guys a different color. But yeah, it's just a really cute minimal bra. I highly recommend this one. This one is on my list of favorites too. Last new items to show you, we have the Origin Collection. So for these ones, I got a medium in the sweatshirt and a medium, did I get a medium? 
Yes, I did. I got a medium in both. This is such a comfy, cute fit. The pants are a straight leg fit, which I really like. It's like a nice switch up. I think it elevates the sweat look a little bit. Personally, that's what I think. I don't know. Very soft. It's lightweight, so it's not really heavy where you feel like, oh my gosh, I'm gonna get so hot in this. Zip up. I told you guys this last time, but I get all of my zip ups and my hoodies in an extra large because I just love an oversized fit. I think it's so cute. I love to drown in my hoodies and my sweatshirts, mainly because it's all I wear. So if I'm cozied up in my home, I wanna be in something super comfy and oversized. They do have a lot of cute colors coming out that you can pair with the other Amplify colors. I just stuck with white this time just cause I don't know, you could wear it with anything. Oh, we barely made it. <laughs> Half of this video will be in the dark. I just wanted to mention some of my favorite things that are not part of the new stuff that's coming out, but still are the things that I have been putting on every single week. And you've probably seen me wearing them in my stories or on YouTube in the last video, my single video. <laughs> Starting off with the stencil hoodie. It's so cute. I have it in black. I think that everyone's kind of overlooking it because they're looking at the two-toned color one. I didn't get the two-toned color one. I got the all black one. And when I went to Houston, everyone was like, wait, which one is this? What hoodie is this? And I was like, it's the stencil hoodie, just in all black. I would wear the black one more. I'm all about getting things that I know that I'm gonna wear every week as opposed to ones that are just like too bright or too out there that I'm not gonna wear them all the time. And then the Earth Dye Graphic Joggers have been another one of my go-tos. Those ones are super lightweight. So they're not the heavy fleecy material. They're more of a, I don't know, they're just really light. I really like to wear those ones as sweats to the gym because they don't have the heavy fleece where I feel it sticking against my legs when I start to sweat. So those ones are really good option if you want to wear some to the gym. Oh, my favorite sports bra out of all of the sports bras, it's the skimpiest one. <laughs> we love a skimpy sports bra. It's the Aura Strappy bra. It's adjustable and there's no padding in it. So there's that. It's I always think I hear things and I always think I'm about to be murdered. Anyway, the joggers I've been wearing this whole video are the Earth Dye Natural joggers. I have these ones in white and black and they just have a little Alpha Elite logo on the back. These ones are my favorite. I just love a neutral. If you want a plain sweatpant that is just, just that, just a sweatpant, these are the ones to get because there's no giant logos anywhere. It's just subtle on the back and it pairs so nicely. Like this is so cute. You could get this whole outfit in black or this whole outfit in white. And it, I just feel like it's such a look. Oh, and then lastly, Alphalete has really cute pump cover tees. They just, they're really cute. My favorite one is the one that has just in yellow lettering on the front, it says Alphalete. I will say, I wish that that was it. I wish we stopped there. I tell you guys, I'm a minimal girl. So I wish when I turned around, you didn't see all of this on the back. <laughs> Nonetheless, I still wear it because I just like the shirt a lot, but it's giving Forever 21 when you pick up a jacket and on the back it says like bad girl or something, you know? But I don't hate it where I'm like, I'm not gonna wear this. I still wear it all the time because I, I, I don't know, I like it. In the pump covers, I get an extra large. I like to drown in them. I like when my elbows are being touched by the sleeves. That's just how I prefer them. <laughs> I thought we were gonna get like a brief that kind of outlined the discounts for all the items, but it's safe to assume all the newer things are gonna be 10% off and all the things that have been on the website older are gonna be the 30, 50% off items. So some of those items I wanted to talk about just because I would be curious if I saw them on the website. I wanna talk about the King Crop hoodie. So that's that Teddy hoodie. It's not as soft as I thought it was gonna be. It's not the cozy, like, oof, this is so soft like a teddy bear. No, it's a little rough. I really thought I was gonna to gravitate to that all the time, but I didn't because it's just not super soft. And then last item I will mention is the classic capital full zip crop jacket. I have this in like six colors. I love this. It's just a nice go-to jacket. If you've been eyeing it on the website, again, now's the time to get it because it's on sale. Might as well just try one out. I get the medium in this one. They're just one of those cute little staple outfits. Those are all the items I'm gonna talk about today. If you guys have any questions, please leave them down below. And remember the giveaway. Anybody who uses my code in the first 24 hours of the sale, please email this email address so you're entered into my giveaway. After the 24 hours are up, I will pick our five giveaway winners and I will immediately send you your gift cards. So if you wanna go back and grab more things, you can. Again, wanna say thank you so much for using my code. It means so much to me. I, appre I just, I appreciate it. I appreciate your support all the time. I love you, friends. I just, I love you guys. What, what would I do without you? I would cry. I do that already, but you know, I would cry more. So yeah, okay. All right, friends. I hope you liked this video and I will see you all next time. So have a great day and a great week and happy shopping. Okay, bye.